Today I'm going to introduce you to an artist who has turned her Instagram account into a love letter to New York City. Amanda, so tell me about Noun New York. Because I know you have a corporate job, you have a day job. I always find myself sketching and then during quarantine I was really missing a lot of the spots that I love most. So I chose the name because I was illustrating people, places and things, but then it became specifically storefronts and restaurant fronts. Uh, and I've drawn about 720 of them to date. How do you pick the restaurants? A lot of them have been commission based at this point, so it's people reaching out, telling me their story of why they love a restaurant. Can you tell me the story behind this one, Stella and Fly? There was a couple that lives around the block that had reached out and found my page on Instagram, and they had asked me to draw Stella and Fly. It was one of their favorite wine bars and cafes. So I drew it for them and they gifted one to the restaurant. And then Nigel, the owner, had reached out after that and asked if I wanted to display any of my work in here. And it seems like your art goes with everything that they stand for here at Stella and Fly. So it's a you know coffee shop by day, wine bar by night, but they're really, they're all about community. They're all about the neighborhood. So it seems like a perfect fit. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the best part about the Upper East Side too. They've been a great audience and so responsive. So as we're walking to our next location, I thought that I would put you to the test. Can you just point out all of the restaurants that you have sketched? Yeah, so I've done Vietnam and I've done Rathbones and I've done this one too. <laughs> And I've done Two Little Red Hens and the Heidelberg. Of course. So now you've brought me to the Penrose, which is one of my favorite spots on the Upper East Side. So thank you, I should say. Mine so too. <laughs> tell me why you chose this restaurant to sketch. I love this restaurant. One of my first apartments was on 66 and 1st, and I used to come here all the time. Yeah, and it, for anybody who hasn't been here, I would just say that the menu, it's, it's comfort food at its best. And it really, it's such a neighborhood spot. You have a lot of work ahead of you, um, and so I got a lot of fuel for you. <laughs> just tell me about the drawing process. So typically I'll work off of an image, whether it be an image that I took or an image that someone sends me, and then I get to illustrating. I usually draw the spots with ink, and then I scan them into the computer uh, and work with them a little bit digitally and then add the color. Amanda, it has to be so special just walking around the city and seeing all the different restaurants that you have sketched and now you have another one to add to your list. Being here today and seeing all these spots and realizing how many places I actually have drawn so far has been incredible feeling. <laughs> Can we do the final reveal? I haven't seen it yet. I love it. And I know they will too. You are such a talented artist and you're doing such wonderful things for all of these businesses and for New York City. So thank you for letting me hang with you today. Oh, thanks for having me today. <laughs>